Hi there. I um I just wanted to uh, do a little tutorial on how to do a make a restart button in a in a Java game. So um I'm just in here. I'm looking at the code for this zombie game that I made a while ago. I'm just gonna walk you through how I how I made the restart button. Um. So basically. Um, as you can see, the game, there's um, a lot of variables. There's just a huge number of variables. Pretty much every single thing that happens in the game is determined by a variable. And so, basically, all the restart button does is it sets all the variables back to what they are here at the beginning of the game. Um, because you know they, they change over time like this one's the location of the of the character so so that would just set the character back to where it starts <clears throat> so um the first thing to do is you have to make a mouse class or a mouse um event um really just you type you type this private class handler implements uh, um, mouse listener. You can this you can change to whatever you want. Um, I just called it handler because I'm simple. Um, so you type that and you make a little little brackets. And inside the brackets, you make a bunch more brackets. One that says public void mouse clicked in parentheses mouse event e, and you can just cut and then two little brackets after that and you can pretty much just copy and paste that over and over again and replace mouse clicked with um, mouse pressed um, mouse released mouse entered <coughs> mouse exited um, you need to make sure you have all of them even if you don't use them you just need to have them all in there so just put all these in there and then and then here's the the code for the restart button if mouse X is greater than restart button X just basically like tell it if the mouse is pressed and the mouse's location is where the restart button is then then set all of the variables to these numbers and these numbers are just all of these I just copied and pasted this whole um, this whole variable section into this whole section and just took out the um, ints um, so then that way when you click on the space that the, re the restart button appears it'll set all the variables back to how they were at the beginning and the game will be restarted and that's uh, that's pretty much that's pretty much how you do it um, and uh, basically just the way I do the restart button let's see if I can find restart uh, yeah here it is I just made a box that is at the variable that I set for the restart button location and then some text over it that says restart and that's um and that's uh and that's how you do it uh so make the box um at a variable location and then tell the mouse um the mouse event that when the mouse is clicked over that variable location set all the all the variables to what they were at the beginning um, I can uh, if you're interested in this code I can I can um, put it online somewhere and you can look at it for yourself but I'm just gonna demonstrate how it works So I uh, click 
click the person, get this weapon, start clicking furiously. Oh no, I died. So now I put the mouse over where the where the button is, press it, and then it sets all the variables back to what they were at the beginning, which causes the game to completely reset. And that's how you do it. So, um, yeah, that's how you make a restart button. I hope it was helpful. Um, if you thought it was good, hit the like button. Um, if there's any else you want to know how to do in Java put it in the comments below and I'll, I'll do another tutorial so um, that's it for now uh, peace out